Well, hello everybody. This is Dave Burkus for Insights from Burkonomics. Today's subject, everyone wants to leave a legacy. Be honest now. Have you ever thought about what legacy you'd leave behind? If you're an entrepreneur or a CEO, surely you've thought about how you'll be remembered by your associates and shareholders as you move on. Well, bad boss examples certainly aren't forgotten. We've all heard the stories of tough SOB bosses that took advantage of employees or vendors or stockholders. And such stories do get around. How many people who know those stories are willing to trust their next chapter to that person's next exit? In my past, I made it a practice to hold exit interviews personally with nearly all separating employees, gaining insights from them that they probably wouldn't have been willing to share while still employed with the company. And invariably, I would ask each one of them, ending with a handshake, and say, I want us to part as friends. We'll never know how we're going to meet again, perhaps with a shoe on the other foot. I didn't know for many years until most successful reunion planned by my former executives brought back many of these employees, over a hundred of them, how much that and other signs of respect and dignity for those employee associates made our workspace rare and desirable. I used to receive a list of birthdays for the next month from my assistant, calling the information from the corporate books spanning offices in many countries. And once a month, I'd maintain kind of a ritual of going to the local gift shop and buying enough birthday cards to fill each employee's or associate's needs. I know we don't use birthday cards anymore, but it certainly worked at the time. And once a month, while watching TV, I'd spend part of an evening writing a personal message about each person and something they had done that year to each employee, recalling an event or complimenting a behavior or a success. Such amazing accidental returns for such a small gesture. Even today, years later, I met at industry events by former employees with this common refrain, our company was the best company I've ever worked for before or since. And you know, it is all about respect and recognition. That's a legacy you can't buy at a cost of acknowledging individuals with respect and personal recognition. And what do I remember about that 10 plus year experience? Among those thrills of rapid growth and great workplace and great lucrative exit? Most of all, it is those personal moments of contact with former employees, each recalling with appreciation their time at the company. Well, this is Dave Burkus for insights from Burkonomics, and this is just one of hundreds available in the books that I've written over time, which I'd appreciate your looking at in any online reseller, including Amazon. Till then, I look forward to seeing you again.